Okay. Oh, crap. Anyways, so I... This isn't the intro, but I just want to preface this video by the one saying... Um, I'm sorry that it's kind of, like, choppy. I filmed it once and didn't like it, and so I refilmed it, but I had to use some old videos. Anyways, I explained it, but, yeah, so it's choppy. Secondly, I said this the first time I filmed it, but I didn't really say this the second time, but I just want to, like, go into this video, having people watch it, knowing that, like, I'm not an organized person on, on a daily basis, so, like, this is me trying to become organized, and, like, I want this to be encouragement for everyone else, like, watching this, I'm like, if she can do it, so can I, because <laughs> if you knew me, you would know that I'm probably, like, one of the most chaotic people in the world. Like, if you saw my dorm room, you would be like, Sophie, are you okay? And I'd probably be like, no. But, yeah, that's the whole point of this video. So, it's currently January 4th. Um... But my canvas is still not updated and I really want to include that in this video. But I might just show you all my old canvas and then like show you all what I did so I can post this. Oh gosh. Okay, I'm gonna be in this one. That's fine. Okay, hey guys. Um, so this little video, as you can tell by the title, is gonna be like a little get ready for 2023 with me. Um, and I've already filmed it once, but I didn't like it, and I was kind of, like, very sporadic with it, so this one, I'm trying to try to be more, like, tight, and so it's shorter, because the current one is currently 30 minutes long, so I've done a lot of the stuff that I wanted to do already, because I was filming the video, so I'm gonna keep the old, the before videos in there, so, yeah, but anyways, so, I want to first start off by writing out a plan of like things that I want to do physically, mentally, like different categories. Um, I'm going to do some research first, like look at other people, let's get some inspo. And then once I do that, I'll come back on here, share that with you guys, and then show y'all what I did to achieve it. So here is just like getting my life together. So what I want style wise, mentally, physically, in my space, things I want to do. I also created like a weekly, monthly, daily routine. Um, I'll insert a picture of that because it's in my notes app. But that's just like stuff that I want to make sure I'm doing to keep my space organized, keep me feeling like, okay, I have a clean space, a clean mind, I can do this. So yeah, so the only other thing I need to do is kind of like organize my school stuff, which once everything gets put into Canvas, I will do and I will show you guys that thing looks like okay she's cute um like see this stuff is all from like my last week of school like I need to update it not that I have anything to do but I just need to like clear it off like that stuff is done okay she's cute I'll, I'll show you guys my I took this template from someone else um so like now these pictures are mine and stuff but like the thing in general is from someone else um, but, like, if you just, like, stuff isn't completely filled out, and, um, like, I just don't like it, and so I think the fact that it makes me unhappy because it's not perfect, and, like, how I want it, I don't use it. Um, so here's my calendar. Okay, so... Obviously, like, as you guys can see, um, everything is, like, pink because I love pink, but I think I might want to, like, like, this looks so, actually, like, it kind of slaves. Anyways, so, like, as you guys can see here, like, I kind of already started what I was talking about, but I think I'm going to add more, like, add specific classes, um, and all that stuff. So that when, like, I add assignment, now, when I add assignments... I do like to add them as tasks so I can like cross them off um so yeah but that is what it looks like okay so I'm just gonna give you guys a little like updated laptop tour because um yeah I fixed it I fixed it everything how I want it to be um and I kind of like it not kind of I I love it and I really think that having this this way is really gonna help me Okay, so when you just turn on my laptop, my lock screen is this 
vision board that I made and I love it like I just think it's so cute and yeah I made it on Canva it was really easy I have the free Canva so like nothing important got all my pictures from Pinterest I made this with Canva also it was a template and I just changed the colors and added pictures and then originally this was like a calendar for like the month but I didn't like one it was really hard to change and you know like it doesn't even tell you like what day it is so instead I switched it to like this weekly this like daily schedule um so I like worked in time to work out eat lunch and do all kinds of stuff for my class schedule and so then I let's open up this so this is my google calendar um I don't know if the clip is in here but as I explained I just went through and I made like a separate calendar for like each thing so like new maroon camp which is like all my classes so when I have like a, an assignment I can just put it in there stuff for AD Pi, social birthdays all that stuff so when it goes in it like so let's say let's add an event today let's say gym and then I'm gonna go here and I'm gonna just change it to whatever the calendar it is so like obviously it's social so we're gonna add that and then save it and then let's say so like obviously you can tell like birthdays oh well birthdays and stuff but yeah so I did that and then I had notion before but I didn't really like using it so I redid it to a simpler template and yeah I really like it and I think I'll be able to keep track more of this so we'll just do a really quick notion tour so when you open it up, this is just the main page. This is the mood board that you guys saw earlier. Just some pictures that kind of fit the vibe. There's nothing behind them. And then I have these fourth, well, these two things. So an agenda, content planner, habit tracker, workouts, school, bucket list, 2023 goals, monthly reflection, budget tracker, shopping list. So we'll just do a quick little rundown. So here's my agenda. It's just... So, like, obviously, I haven't really been using it, um, that much, but the week, I need to change this, and then, um, just Monday, Tuesday, weekly task, next week, next month, um, and then we have content planner, which is what it seems like, this is a link to all of my accounts, um, and I got this template from a girl, I will link the YouTube video in my bio, so like videos that I want to plan, okay, and like filming, I filmed this, um, published, and then like, yeah, so that's what that is, and then we have a habit tracker, which is this for January, so I haven't really filled anything out yet. Um, but it just has waking up, going to sleep, working out, my skincare, and then there's like a little archive for everything else. And then we have, sorry, I keep saying and then, there, we have this workout. I haven't done anything yet to it, but I really want to school. This one came from a different template, but I switched it over because I really wanted something to keep my school organized. So just probably shouldn't show that but it's fine um things for next semester and then all my classes um this little assignment thing where I can just add the assignments for like every class and I can just have easy access to it but if you also go into the class itself there is also an assignment thing so like this will be just for this class and also I don't know if you guys noticed but I added this little grade thing and it has like a little bar and so it's divided by a hundred so like if i have a hundred like the bar is completely full but like anything else like there's like a little portion missing and i really like that because it's like kind of a visual but yeah so this just has what class um the credit hours if it's honors professor what days the halls the grades um i need to add like the course codes but yeah, and so once I get all of my stuff from Canvas, I'll show you all my Canvas organized and then I'll add all of the stuff to here. And then a calendar, so like classes start. 
and then let's see what else so i haven't done anything to these two yet but here's this monthly reflection um yeah 2023 goals this i just took out of my things and then i changed the pictures to stuff that i feel like represents me look at this little beatles picture so cute so lastly a bucket list just some things very simple and then i have just these two pictures i made this too um I just get the pictures on Pinterest and then like collage them on Canvas and Canva and I Canvas and then I have these two weather things so this one's for Starkville where I go to school and this one's for like my home and that's my Notion. So I think I want to start using Notion more now that I have this I want to download it back on my phone and I just want to try you know obviously if it doesn't work for me it doesn't work but I think with my less the way that I have it set up now it'll be less intimidating and I'll actually probably stick to it more because oh my gosh what about YouTube videos <laughs> is like playing but my other one I kind of felt was like really chaotic and all over the place and I really didn't know how to use it I didn't know what was what and it was just kind of confusing for me so I think I'm gonna start simple use that and then kind of build from there so yeah so that's what I did today um, and I'm just gonna say I'm not the best with Notion so like this like find a youtube video so what i did is i searched up a youtube video um i actually will tell y'all who i use her name's michelle and i really just typed in like notion like how to let's see if it pops up um notion organization yeah and it was like the first one that popped up her name is michelle I'm not even going to try to say her last name because I'm definitely going to butcher it. But there's so many, like, on here. That you can use. So. Yeah, that's just the template I used. And then I added my own personal touches. Took some things away. Added some things. Um, basically, that's it. So that's what my laptop looks like right now. Um, and then I also, along with my digital planner, I have a like real planner, which I love. Um, it's from Target. I think it was like $12, but it comes with like these cute little stickers and stuff. But so I'll just show y'all like what I do with that. So firstly, I have this little like code to like remind me whenever I'm filling stuff out, like what the different highlighting means. Um, I don't know why I have two words. Ignore that. But, yeah, so I'll just take y'all to... Okay, so, like, let's say this was September, so I go through, write all the dates, and then I highlight it according to what category it falls under. So, yeah, so here's December. I need a highlight. Well, I should have highlighted December, but, you know, we're slacking. And then, so it has the monthly breakdown, and then it goes into a weekly breakdown, and so it has the days... And the week starts on Monday. Um, so it has that. And then on this side, it has like a goal of the week. Study, because I was doing exams. And then a to-do list. Some priorities next week. And then it has like the ne the two month breakdowns. So yeah. I did not use it much in December because I wasn't doing anything. Let's try to find. Okay, so like this is November. Um, it also has a habit tracker, which I kind of use, like, this summer. If I can find one. Let's see. Yeah, so I kind of use it. Pretty bad at it, but let's find. So, yeah. So, that's just what it looks like. So, my goal. Okay, I'm so ex sorry for how I look right now. I am actually, like, in bed about to go to sleep, but... Uh, one of my classes is posted to my canvas and so I decided to kind of show you guys what I do for that. So yeah. Okay, so this is a class. Um, I'll just check what this says. Anyways, this is what it looks like. So the first thing that I go on here, I fix it. So like as you can see, it says the course code and I'm just going to change that to like what I know the class as. 
Okay, so once that's finished, I'm gonna just click apply, and then the next thing I'm gonna do is find like kind of a color scheme for my pictures. I did pink last time, but I think I might wanna like coordinate it to this. So early US history is orange, so I'm gonna just go find orange on a color hex thing and make it that color. So obviously I could just choose this orange and apply that, but I kind of want them to be more like pastel-y and girly. So we're just gonna control V and copy and apply. And now it's kind of this like pastel color. And we're also gonna make this a little more pastel while we're at it. So I'm just gonna go here, drag this down to the pink section, right about there, control copy, and then just, Control V and then once that's set and then once these are set I can go back in here and copy these paste it into here and find the colors for the other ones once those get added So now that that's kind of done and this is set I'm gonna just go see what the announcement says and show you all some more so here's a syllabus so I'm just gonna download it and um, Kind of store it in I don't even know so I just downloaded the syllabus I'll kind of read through it later but I'm just going to go to the thing and upload it. So we're going to upload, choose a file, this one, open, beautiful. And then now I can add the email and hours. I just added my professor and my TA's name because my TA is in charge of my section. Um, I took them out for privacy reasons, but... Yeah, so that's what that looks like. The syllabus and big projects, which are the exams. And the final exam, like, date hasn't been put in, so that's why there's no date. But, yeah. Okay, so another thing that I'm going to show you guys is I have this calendar, this, like, folder called school. And I just add a folder for each class and then add the important documents to it. So, I'm just going to go to downloads. And just move everything over to school. Move to school. Oh shoot, sorry. It's really hard to like see what I'm doing. Move here. And then move here. And then you're gonna select this one. And then select this one. I'm just gonna move those to early use history. Move there. And then that way, like, everything is in one spot. So I have my books that I need. I can delete this. I have it paper version. But, yeah. Essentially, that's how everything is going to be for my school. Um, I'm really excited to get it, like, set back up. Um, and, yeah. I hope you guys enjoy this video. And I hope that it motivates you guys to kind of get your life together for 2023. If you haven't already, which is totally okay, like some people just need that extra motivation. And even if you have, this might have given you more ideas. And even if not, I hope you enjoy it.